what we've got going on is, uh, <laughs> of all the deer, Bruce, we saw him limping a couple days ago. And uh, yesterday, he, he was just holding it right up. I mean, he wouldn't even put it down on the ground. So we just darted him. So we're going to go out and see what's wrong. It's his front left foot. And what's funny is that's the foot we had a problem with last year. And that's what stopped that G2 from growing when we darted him. So this is actually earlier in the growing uh, season of the antler. But uh, it's still going to stop his growth for about a week and a half. So keep the deer alive rather than losing. Well, what we've got is we've got a broken toe um, right here, front foot. You can see the crease right through here. Um, so the whole end is, it's not broke off, but we've got to relieve some pressure. We'll build a cast around it, but we've got to clean it up first, so we're going to separate it. Um, could be worse, could be better um, once we clean it and see what it is, but it's got to hurt. I mean, Trying to walk on it, now we know why he's limping. So, too messy out there in the field. And I gotta see what is happening, so. That pad's all tore up too. Flush it. Yeah. You're going to come around and start getting some of the antibiotics and stuff ready to go. Pretty nasty looking. We still haven't got all the crud out of there, but we're going to have to trim some of it back. Hope we can take the pressure off the end. This one doesn't look as bad. That's our problem right there is that break. You can see the line comes through on an angle right there. It's actually a better look of it right there. That's not good. Go ahead and give it to him. Front shoulder. Hey. Good morning. <laughs> That'll take a bunch of pressure off that. It'll put more of his weight back here rather than on his front when he walks. Problem is you don't want to go into the cuticle. So it's a guessing game of where it is down in there. Um, the more we can get off and closer to where that break is, the less pressure, you know, it's like putting pressure out here and it broke here. If we put pressure right where it's broke, it hurts, but you don't have that bending. Um, uh, I don't dare go any further. Um, uh, seven cc's new flurry and sorry. All you do is ask. Also, I saw you standing, sitting there looking at me. That's about all we're gonna get out of that one too, Scott. But yeah, it does look much better. There's still the break, but much, much less sticking out there. I'm almost wondering. Okay. Well, we definitely can't go any further. Okay. Um, rinse it all down again. The other problem we've got right now is everything is so muddy outside. It's just nasty. So they're just 
grinding everything into the dirt. Bad time to have this. Yeah. You want me to do it? You want it? Just stick some on. Some more anyhow, right? Yeah, we'll want more. Please, high and quarter. Yeah, that side's fine. I just wanted to fill that okay. hole in, cool. to be honest with you. New toe, temporary toe. In this weather, that'll stay on for probably a good five days, which allows that to heal from the inside out. Right there is where I darted him. Yeah, he's clean. Two, four, five cc's of reversal okay. in a fresh needle. Mm -hmm. What we're giving him, uh, as far as medicine, we gave him two different types of antibiotics. Um, to keep the infection out in the way. And we gave him some dexamethasone, which is an anti-inflammatory. And then we gave him some vitamins and minerals, uh, selenium and a vitamin B booster, which uh, ups his appetite. Well, it could have been worse. It could have been a lot better. It could have just been a long toe trim, that's it. But the break, um, I had to get it to where there's pressure off that brake, so we got one clip too far on the cuticle too. So see how he does. Wake him up, and the next few days will tell. I got it. Go to your right. Grab his head. Yep. Go ahead and take that cover off. You want to grab that syringe in. We can pull him back this way a little bit and that'll help his head. Helps out a lot. Levels his body out. Awesome. Thank you. finish everything up, we'll clean everything up and hop with them. I'm going to take the four-wheeler. 